guys, it's Queen Nija, and in today's video, I will be reacting very to episodes 1 and 2 of Noragami Arigato. I mean, like, damn, what can I say about this? We finally got to this after all that bullshit of my channel and stuff, but, um, before I start, a lot of people, originally, I was going to watch the OVAs, 1 and 2, but everyone has now told me to wait until the end of this season to watch all four OVAs. So I think I, I've also been told to watch the first six episodes, then watch the two OVAs from season one, watch seven to 13, and then watch Arigato's OVAs. I don't know how the hell I'm going to do this. I'm still deciding. I think probably maybe by the time I get to three and four next week, I will have an answer. I might just wait until I'm done with season two overall and then just watch all four OVAs and put it together like one big movie or I'll do the first six watch the one to season one then seven to thirteen and then watch I don't know we'll freaking see but other than that let's go ahead and get started and three two one go I really kind of wish I didn't go this because it was so good and I need some water are you okay oh Is that Bisha? What the hell happened? Oh, okay. Um, all right, that's from the past. Okay. Okay. Um, <laughs> and now I'm on the good song. As much as I love the song from season one, I love the song. It's so good. I've been listening to it like freaking non stop. Uh, I might have to ask my significant other questions tonight. I don't know about this because. Uh, Oh no, yeah. Why out of all times would she have dreams about the past? Like, you would assume that she would have had it in season one when, you know, she was trying to kick Yato's ass, but uh, no, confused. What about Nora? What the fuck is Nora going to be planning on this? Like, that's no, what's your deal? Ugh! <laughs> And then these two. Don't worry. My Yuki. <laughs> I'm recording. See, that looks so good, but I had food, like, what, two hours ago? My late lunch. Yep. <laughs> it was like nothing to me.
Yeah, so I'm not baby. The hell are you about to Uh-huh. Smell. Duh. Mm -hmm. Yeah, like really little kids can see spirits because apparently my mom has told me, um, because I don't remember this, I've seen my dead great 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 grandfather as a kid and I was playing with him. <laughs> oh. Uh -huh. Um, why don't you get the baby to Hiyori? Because... Okay! <laughs> no. Exactly, there you go. Got the baby. <laughs> yeah. Even with the baby in the room, I mean, y'all could just open the, you know, the blinds and the windows, have a little bit of room. Yeah, especially with the fact that it looks like a damn bunny. Oh. It's creepy in a cute way. Yeah. So, do you just like break the mirror? That's going to make people not want to have kids, you know. Um, I'm just saying, but like, baby, thank you. Yeah. And then when they become, when they become actual kid kids, oh, nightmare.
Iya. You could at least clean. Huh? Wasn't that Nora's mask? Oh, Andrea, my baby. Guys, with the baby <laughs> I literally forgot that I received emails on my laptop. <laughs> God, that's so pretty. Just wanna like slim it that. Yes. Ah, oh, best girl. <laughs> <laughs> oh Jesus, are you okay? No. Uh, what the heck? <laughs> okay, computer, what the frick did you just do? Why would you pause it? If it <laughs> oh, look, you got him. The necklace. And see, now I'm zooming again. What the frick are you doing, laptop? I think after I'm done, I'm gonna have to restart you. Uh, uh. Huh? Yeah. Because of the dream, the past, and everything. Yeah, I can understand that. But you need to at least apologize to her. Oh, damn. Are you sure about that?
I mean, damn, she has so many. Yes, and I love that. She gives no fucks, and I love that. Like, damn! Yes! <laughs> no wonder why she's, like, I think, what, my third best girl on the show? God, that looks so gross. I mean, can't you just like, oh! You know, honestly, I thought she was going to pull it out, but... Uh. Are you going to heal her, Elliot? Well, it was just like that. Okay. And how many does she have? I feel like she has like 20. I, I mean, but she could have like 10. A mirror? Ah. So then what the fuck is she going to do with it, though? Oh, oh. Yeah, do you still feel lonely though? After everything you went through in season one? My baby's on a rookie. Wait, hold on, you can see him? Huh? How do you. Are you one too? Oh. Oh, you, you're gonna get a friend! Oh my god! <laughs> oh my. Woman, how many teeth? Jesus Christ, that is like. That's a colony. That's a town of people right there. Like, in this whole house. How big is your place? Why do you look like Chica? <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> Oh, well, she ain't gonna be nice like she could. Okay. That's all right. See, you say that, and then something bad is gonna happen. Let, let's think about that. I mean, it's happened like, in so many different animes that I've seen. So 
so then what if the guy that Yuki just met belongs to Fishy? It's maybe. Honestly, that makes me want to have a bath, and I, I don't take baths like that. I'm a shower girl, so. Which is? Yep, because he made a friend. No, let him be a kid. He made a friend, damn it. Yeah, I'm hoping that they get something, like, that fixed. Because, I mean, we on season two. We don't even know if this dang show is going to get a season three. I mean, you know, Studio Bones with the My Hero Academia. You know, like, maybe after My Hero Academia season four comes. Maybe after that. Like, I would want that. Please do it. I want to know. Because a lot of people have said, after this, it gets really good. <laughs> No, I feel like he knows I'm just lying. Mm -hmm. Damn, we about to be some star-crossed lovers in this ish. Mm. Oh. So then why the fuck did that dude have a mask? Uh, nope, I don't trust him. Mm -mm, mm -mm, mm -mm, mm -mm. But it, like, it was nice. Like, oh my god. It felt like it's been a month or so since I had watched this show. And mm, to finally continue it, felt like seeing an old friend. And just, mm, I don't know. Like, would, it, would I say that it kind of continued right where it finished? I don't think so. I still need to see the trash scene. So I'm guessing that's going to be in this season. Hopefully, because a lot of people, like most of my subs, know I am literally waiting for that episode and that moment. They look so cute together. Mm. No, I'm gonna say it anyway. I think in the manga, probably they're maybe already together because you can just tell, like, the sexual chemistry between those two is just nuts. And it's just like, you look at them and it's like, why haven't they done it already? Or why haven't they kissed? And that's what I feel when I look at Yuki. <laughs> Not Yuki. Yori Yato. It's just it's right there. And it's just like, you do it. Like drugs. It's right there. Just come on, damn it. But I'm not surprised that the kid belongs to Visha. Because I knew it. I, it's like, you're lying, you little thing. Like, but he's so adorable. There's the chica looking girl. So now you're working with Nora? 
but why would you want to work with her? Why would anyone want to work with her? I mean, just to get Yato back, but... Uh. Bitch, I'm just going to call you Nora. That's it. Useful for what? See, no. <laughs> Why would you say that? Like, what is this planning? I, like I said, I, I've never liked her. Honestly, what the fuck is she planning? And I bet all of you right now are like snickering, like, <laughs> if you only knew. I like just fucking tell me, but then I'm like at the same time, no, don't tell me because I don't want to know anything. I I need to check my phone real quick. Hold on one second. That's fine. <laughs> See, whatever their plan is, it has to be dealt with that kid. Because why would he be watching over Yuki and this kid? Yuki, what you tell him about your friend? Of course it's the answer fault. It's always his fault. Yes. You made a friend? I mean, come on. He's a kid. He's happy about that. I mean, you have to, when you were a kid, weren't you happy when you had a, <laughs> when you had a friend? Oh. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Yeah. And it was always alone. Now he's not alone. Yeah. Let's see what Yato finds out. <laughs> that is Bisha. <laughs> but like, I forbid you to talk to him. <laughs> Gone. <laughs> Bye. Screw homework. Now see if it was a girl. Oh, it would have been even better, but she's not. Hey. <laughs> I know for the first time in a while. No, 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 because if Bisha finds out, oh. 
You know, it's really like dancing. <laughs> yeah. She got way too many. I mean, the fact that she has this big-ass house, that all of them are there, and that they're safe, it's so sweet. Like, oh my god. It's like an orphanage for them. Like, ah! Oh my god. I mean, in a way, she doesn't need to. She's got her group, and just the rest of you are there to just live with her. Until eventually, you know, she's going to use too much, and she's going to die. Which, I'm thinking that's gonna happen. You must have died when you were really young. God, she's getting sunflowers. She doesn't remember you. Oh, but you fell in love with her, of course. But not you. Mm -hmm. Oh my god, no, what a heart. Mm-mm. But that was so sweet. Uh, hey, Yata. Well, you can do chores, it's fine. Oh, hung out with his friend today. No. Good question. <laughs> I mean, yes, yeah, she does because she cares for you both. 
No, baby. No. No. I don't like that guy. Why did you do something like that? Shut up. <laughs> oh, that looks so good. Oh, green tea, too. Yeah. Huh. But you, you don't know, baby. Oh my god.
Have you seen them? You better ask that motherfucking doctor that's what you want me to ask. So why the fuck did he kill him? Why the fuck did he have him killed? What is this plan with Mora? What the fuck is going on? I don't like this. No. Nina. That oh. has to be the doctor's doing. I mean, it's obvious. No, I don't think it's Chica looking girl. It's the doctor. Of course, it's not going to be easy like that. I mean, but it's him. Hello? I need to check his ass for a second. Let me check you. Especially you have little kids there too. But it's one of you. It has to be you. You're no 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 no. You know no no. He could be having like makeup on just like mm, mm. Yes. Yes. Gone. He was for sure. I even saw it. Mm. I, I honestly just want to pour a drink for Susan. <laughs> Of course.
Mm-hmm. Let's see here. Nice. Oh, damn. Damn. Oh, okay. Mm-hmm. No, you are. You are. That's the thing that's gonna be dealt with. Mm-mm. I don't like this. Nope. Mm-mm. Mm-mm. No. Mm-mm. 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 I don't like him. I don't like her. That bitch. Fuck that bitch. Yes. Mm-mm. <sighs> to oh, she still does have it. Of course. It is him. So then how in the world did he, did it not show on her? Because now everyone's going to think that Cosm is the one that is the betrayer, but we all know it's not. It's him. It's obvious. Like, why would you kill Siza? Like, I mean, come on. It's just made a friend with Yuki. It's like you tarnished my heart. What is wrong with you? Why would you do that? Like, come on, man. It's so mean. Oh my god, my baby Yuki doesn't have a friend anymore. I'm like, come on. I mean, there are so many people in the world who just want to see the world burn. It's that doctor. It's most of the cash from the goddamn, um, uh, fucking, um, Boogie Pop, uh, made a little bit of Isabella before Isabella took her hair down in the last episode of freaking Promise Neverland. And anybody else, I can say. Just, oh my god, why would you want to do this to my precious cinnamon roll? And then, you know, Canela from SAO, who freaking killed Hiyashio, my son! My baby is dead, and that still hurts. It's only Sunday, and it hurts really bad. I miss my baby. I like the episode, though, because, come on. Why did you do that? This <laughs> I hate this. <clears throat> Excuse me. Mm. Of course, Yuki's gonna go there and just ask about Suzu. I was like, oh, I can't. It hurts. Why? Like, no. If you would have told me this at the end of season one saying, hey, you know, when you get to season two, the first two episodes, a lot's gonna go down. Like, why? 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 Oh my god, it was two little boys. He just needed a friend, and now he's alone, and he has nobody. He has Yori, he has Yato, but to have someone who's not Hiyori and Yato all the time, it's just, it's nice. To see someone brand speaking new is hella nice. But then, like, to just take them away, to have them meet in episode one, and then for them to just die the following episode, like, that is a little fucked up to me. I, I just want to know, and this could even happen in the rest of season two going on into the manga, because I don't even know if, I, I'm a little skeptical if I will read the manga after I'm done with this show. Like, does, does Yuki get to have another friend that doesn't die? Because, like, this is so mean. Why would you do this? I mean, you're a doctor. Why would you freaking come up to someone who has so much goodness in their heart and positivity and just, like, take everything 
throw them away like a piece of gum and just be like, oh yeah, no one's going to remember you. You know, she's honestly forgot about you. Like your master has forgotten about you too. You have no one. And then to say almost the same things to Yato, like, but honestly, I can see that happening to him. Hiyori is the only one who knows him. And if Hiyori forgets, he's screwed. A guy, like, the god dies. There is no god. I don't know. I am skeptical about what the heck is gonna happen with this season. I am scared. I have so many feelings about this. But other than that, guys, that is my reaction to Detroit's episode 1 and 2 of Noragami Arigato. If you guys enjoyed it, please give me a like. It really helps me out. Also, subscribe to my channel. I make videos every single day. Join the Marshall Squad. And of course, I will see you guys all officially next Monday for episode 3 and 4. Bye, guys!